Hi everyone, this is part 28 to our Around the World requests, and we're going to bring everything together now to show all of our evidence. And this is especially for all of the people that have been with me for the last few years, from all the way back when we all started and we mapped out all of the world, all of the geography, just as right here, this one satellite world image. We had covered every aspect, and then in the last few years, we have verified what we have found here in every single way possible from every bit of evidence from every avenue around the world traveling from cities and different you know looking into every area music videos and movies and each every city geography and proving that the Lord God has controlled everything we are revealing the mystery of God right in front of us well we're going to go ahead and verify a few things today. Remember as we've been showing for years that this is the big head wound right here. This is the map that we have verified on my channel several times right here. Even with this big alien influence coming right here and this stone that is coming. This guy, this big blue guy, he is actually this same man right here receiving a giant head wound and then America rises up with this big horse like thing to, to go off and become the new world order you can see the big Indian riding him all of this is right here and we've shown all the way over to this side where it shows several different entities Jesus throwing down this big head which is actually Australia and then you can even see the real mark of the beast right here they're doing something with this snake they're doing something with the eyes and then they're closing off the mouth and you can see how the Lord God has this right by China North Korea all right here and Russia the big red army all rising up for the Great Tribulation you can even see right here this big skate where we have shown that the Pallades is with this stone falling on the foot right here. All of this is right in front of us and you can even see Africa as the little horn rising. So it plays out just like this. This alien thing comes with this stone and as we show him, the bull falling on top of the bull. He gives himself his own head wound to the world and then he goes over with Russia and China. The little horn rises up and then here comes all of the mark of the beast. We're going to show the mother figure today, <clears throat> and as well as everything, we're going to go into all of this in depth. So let's show right here about that stuff. Right here you can see the head wound. See right here as we have been showing? This man receives the head wound and then look at the back of his head it is opening up and here is the little horn now above him this is not that easy to see but this is the mother figure falling basically on top of him let's show her she's right here just like this matching scripture <coughs> excuse me the great head wound happens see the head wound right here and then the woman gives birth this is the mother figure here on earth the woman that will be caught away with us all she is right here and she has a pregnant belly let's take a look at her closely well, here she is right here just like this she is really like a mermaid if you've been following me we're gonna be able to figure out some things here remember as I keep showing about that one boot and that one leg she is like a mermaid here until she puts on this other leg see this leg right here Saudi Arabia and everything starting with Jerusalem as the top God even has this for a reason as Jerusalem at the top blocking the way in nobody can get into the big boot as we keep showing 
because this represents the Pleiades, the link between heaven and the stars. And you can see her belly right here is pregnant. <clears throat> this is her. She is pregnant right here. And when she gives birth, everybody goes into the leg. As we've shown, you go into your our next existence. We go into the leg for the oil, and the leg is taken to heaven. And she is taken off to the wilderness. Right here is an arrow ready to go out, as we've shown before for the birth. Right here. Jesus here, the front of this lion, casting down this man with the hair to the side. We will see him. The bull falling on the bull. And here is the woman. She gives birth at the time when she shoots the arrow. And we go through the dog star's mouth. And Jesus spits all the lukewarm Christians out of his mouth. We are anointed right here. We are birthed into our new immortal bodies. And by being anointed, that takes all the sins away. You should have read the Old Testament and seen where the Lord God anointed David. And when you're anointed, you're clean. And then it begins these guillotines up here. We're going to show all of this. The leg, now the only way to get in is the guillotines. We'll show all that through here too. But you see the arrow? Matching scripture, the woman taken off to go to the wilderness for her time right here and right here by the Suez Canal is her vagina ready to give birth and she gives birth when the great head wound happens at that point in time let's go back to our other map right here you can see the person riding the beast that looks like Obama you see this person right here he has England in one hand and then this other hand he takes off a mask but right here at Italy you can see that Sicily makes the stone that falls on the foot of this system and then we are birthed this is the head wound when the stone falls the millstone and that is what's keeping the birth from happening that foot is holding everybody down see this foot right here is holding the birth from happening when the head wound happens, she can give birth. Everything's being revealed. Perfect. As we've been showing all around the world. So that is the birth right there when the head wound happens. <clears throat> this head wound. Now up here at that point in time, after that, as we saw the Indian rising up right up here you see America now after all this rises up starting to fight to become the new world order after the great head wound and you can see the dragon right here persecuting the woman see the dragon persecuting the woman meaning China and Russia and everybody are coming and at this point in time that's when that arrow is launched so she can get out of here you can even see this arrow right there. I have very large breakdowns of all this. We have verified these for hours at a time on there. There's the arrow. It's right about here. And it even has the swirlies, as I've been showing. We go through like a, it looks like the Norway spiral. We go through a big spiral. That's what the gate keeps showing for the souls. So there's the head wound, the woman falling and giving birth. There's the big Indian, as we've seen, rising up, which again we saw over in the Denver Airport murals. These match these, I mean, this matches this stuff. Here's that Indian riding the red bull. There's the rapture, the guillotines, and then this winged disc, and then the world is redone. It's all matching exactly what Lord God has planned out here. The arrow going with the big bull falling. All perfect with scripture. And right here in front of us. Now right over here, you can see that alien thing coming with the stone. Right? 
here. Here he is. This is that little horn guy coming right here. And he has this big stone falling on him too. See him coming in this big boat? Not easy to see, but he's right there. And he's right here. See this big ship coming? And there he is laying down, ready to get up. It's like this big boat. And it lands right down near San Diego and they nuke the crap out of the area. Excuse me. But then it's it's going to be it's big time coming. So there he is. We will show this on Google Earth to verify it. So there we go. That's what we have been verifying the whole time on our channel, over and over again. This is what's coming. This is how it goes. You can see the head wound. When this guy comes with the big stone coming, the little horn rises, and the great deception happens, and then the woman gives birth, and then she's caught away with the wings of an eagle. Perfect. And you can see right here, excuse me, you can see right here the dragon persecuting the woman really easy. So let's put that there. All right, let's go show this on Google Earth quickly and verify all this again, because we're going to show something new. The Lord God even shows the guillotines and things right over here. So there we go. The great head wound is when the birth happens, and that's when we are caught away, and the great tribulation begins that day or that night, overnight, suddenly. Okay, let's go deep, right here by South America. We're going to show this guy right here in his ship coming. The tip of his ship, this is how deep our research has gone, the tip of his ship is right here by the Nazca lines where I showed that the spirits are actually farming all of us right out of the earth and preparing everything and the Lord Jesus had every single thing mapped out over here all about the heavenly realms and the star systems we mapped all of that out also I have some very long breakdowns of the Nazca lines and it's all showing about Jesus Christ and how all of the earth is built for to create all of us the link between the earth and the spiritual realms to create all of our souls so let's go show this guy right here here he is right here let's do it like this first this is him in his ship and he's sitting right here feeding on the Nazca lines whatever is how they're forming the souls this is the stone it even has the big boot basically on it. This is the foot of Jesus Christ being bruised. The heel. This is the end coming, the day the dead rise. But that's him right there. Let's get rid of that ship part. Just look at him for a second. This is what we have been verifying over and over and over again in every way possible. That all this is coming. This is that ship that we just saw at the Denver Airport murals. This big ship right here. And then the rainbow bridge for all of us to get out of here. And then that guy is up and out of his boat basically and he has but a short time. There he is. That's the great head wound coming. This is this big guy. For everybody that has watched Prometheus, this is that big blue guy inside of that ship coming. This is the big head wound right here. You can see all of it right here, as we showed. 
Okay, well that's verified. Now let's go over here. This is where she would give birth. Up through her legs up here. And down here, this is the Great Tribulation going now. All down here. There is even a big line of people in line for the Great Tribulation. This is when the DNA is intermingled, and this is when the separation happens. You can see New York, the Statue of Liberty, underwater. This is the big guy known as the Idle Shepherd with his right eye darkened. This is the boot, as we keep showing, like the skate. And then this is the woman being put in. First off, you have this guy that comes, the little horn, and falls on the foot right there. And he has like a hook in his hand. And that's when everybody is raptured. And then the rest of the people have to go to these guillotines right here. And then this red stuff is their oil so they can get into the boot. There is even this pirate sitting right here. The same thing over and over again that we've been showing all around the world. You go through the dog star to get in this way, or you have to go up to the guillotines to go through the oil. So you buy your oil as the foolish virgins. And there's the pirate, right there by the guillotines. There's the pirate, right here by the guillotines, matching everything perfectly. And this falling on the foot. We don't know about dates. We, you know, that's up to the Lord God. When everything's ready is when he says it'll happen. You see here on this Mayan calendar, this little horn falling on this foot. This will happen before Obama's presidency is over. We have found the evidence on that. But that's up to the Lord God when this all happens. But there's the little horn falling on the foot. Here's this guy, this little horn, with the stone falling on the foot. All, it's perfect. Everything going on perfectly. So let's go ahead and back this off and look in here. You can even see the pirate giving this man the mark of the beast. I have been showing this for three years, and for the last three years or so, we have been verifying all of it. We have all of the world mapped out now. So let's go in closer here and show this. Let me show this part too as we get this done here. As they're going through the skate, you can see right here where it says reunion. These things are not mistakes. This is where we're on the way into the wedding feast of the Lamb and such. Everything, everybody's reunited right then to get into heaven. So you can see the little horn guy right here, as we've been showing over and over again with that hook right here. He's the bull with the hair out to the sides, making the bull horn. He has the little horn on his head. Just like that. He has that hook to come and deceive the world. Now he's falling on the boot. Perfectly. The skate. You can see the these are the foolish virgins that had to go buy their oil by the skate, by the guillotines down here. We went in right here, basically through the dog star, right in through the bottom. Well, those the rapture do. All of us are Christians. Whatever your task is from the Lord, we will have to do it. There will be many tribulation saints that will bring glory to the Lord on their crazy adventure through the great tribulations. So we have that right there. You can even see the woman perfectly. And with the scenario each time, perfect. You have the little horn falling on there again. Right here. And then the sleeping guy getting up out of his boat or whatever to go off and deceive the world. Now down here, let's look at the false pro the idle shepherd real quick Let's put him right here right
right here, this alien. And notice that he is getting a head wound. See how the skate has hit him in the head? He is getting a head wound. This is that head wound happening. And then the blood up to for the oil. Sitting right there. Oops, that's Statue of Liberty. And now below him, you can actually see the Statue of Liberty. <clears throat> this is one of the hardest ones to see here. Just like in the old movies with New York underwater, which is supposed to happen in the USA. The USA goes down in one hour, and it's, it's a cataclysmic, world-shattering event. Basically, the earth, the biggest earthquake can ever happens. The big one in California happens, rocking the whole planet. The day of the Lord is coming when his heel is bruised. Okay, so we saw that. <clears throat> Let's leave him there. Now, right here, you can see one of the better looks of one of the guys. First, we'll do the DNA strip. See this DNA strip? Now down to here, to the line of Tribulation Saints. You can see these guys very easily. We'll put them first. And then you can see the line of them behind them. You can even see their little faces in there when you go in there real close. Literally. The Earth is a prepared matrix. We're not in an electronic machine, but the Earth, the Lord God made all the universe perfect. He can do all this. <clears throat> so that we have that there, and the DNA strip. Now let's get this pirate guy up here. Let's get rid of the DNA strip. And the, let's show it like this. Here's the pirate, and he has a marked man in his lap, like this. So let's go in here and look at him. So you can see the marked man right here. And now you can see the pirate. And we verified all this. I mean, every way possible. And he has the guillotines. So that's what we have there. And with the DNA strip. And with the Statue of Liberty. And with the alien getting the head wound. And with the little horn falling. And then the boot, <clears throat> as we kept showing. This is the boot that the woman takes off. That the, the woman that is like a mermaid. The mother figure. And don't worship any of these entities. Even that mother figure, if you worship her, she's not going to like that. Because Jesus Christ is the seed of the woman. And she is the woman. So she's going to want everybody worshiping her son, Jesus Christ. Just as God wants everybody to come to Jesus Christ. He wants everybody to go to him. It, your sins are forgiven. Come to him. Just call out to him and make a personal relationship with him. It's That is what this is all about. He will decide about everything, not man. We'll be all okay. <clears throat> so we saw all of this. It's all right here in front of us, easily seen. Look at that. It's all real. It's all really coming. God is going to line everybody up like this for the Great Tribulation. All accusers, even if you're a Christian, most of them are going to this line because they have fallen away from mercy. Forgive everybody. I mean, let's hope everybody is at the wedding feast of the Lamb. Everybody. Uh, let's not be surprised to see whoever is there. Whatever person you've ever had a problem with, forgive them. We have to go for mercy. So all of this is right here perfect with scripture. 
and matching everything we've shown around the world. So there we go. We don't know when, and as we've been teaching on my channel, we need to all pray for mercy. This can happen anytime. Obviously, the Lord God can make any type of worlds and create anything and set us all there and create his own type of thing going on, and he will fix this world. One of the reasons all, everybody's being forced to Jesus Christ is because that will that will bleed out any other type of spiritual things around all the demons and everything they will be starved out so this is what why God's plan is to have everybody go to Jesus Christ for salvation to get rid of these demons that are causing all of the sins it's not just the flesh that's doing this it's the spirits and most Christians don't even realize that there are spiritual things around they continually blame the person instead of the spirit that might have them. The man that had legion in him, 2,000 murdering spirits, all of humanity locked him away and threw him away, and Jesus came and set him free. He will do the same to all of us too. He can set us all free and get rid of all of the... He can weed us all out. He's going to do it. Now you can see the Earth Mother right here, as we've shown. See right here? See how she has this one leg that is ready to come off at any time? This is where all the souls go when they're born. Zoop! Right in there. And then she goes off to the wilderness when that stone falls, just as Sicily is sitting on the tip of Italy. All is perfect. And then she gives birth because this foot is holding us down during that time. Confess with your mouth. The Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart. God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. It's real and all around us, right in front of us. The mystery of God is being revealed right in front of us. There's the head wound. There's the earth mother. Here's the little horn over here. And we even have the big Indian guy waking up right there as the dragon persecutes the woman. And the woman is set free with that arrow, just as we showed all around the world. Thank you very much, everybody. Call out to the Lord Jesus. Talk to him and have a personal relationship with him. And let's have mercy for everyone. Hallelujah.